Hey, Fuel fans, welcome inside our WebStream Sports Studios for another edition of Fuel Insider with Fuel Forward, defenseman, kind of utility guy, Kirill Gotovets. I'm Tony Brown. Kirill, thanks for being here. Thanks for having me. Let's start with your background a little bit. Uh, grow up in Belarus, you played your college hockey at Cornell, drafted by the Tampa Bay Lightning. Take us through sort of your journey through hockey. Uh, well, I, like you said, I started playing hockey when I was still in Belarus, about when I was eight years old. And then up until 17, I still played there. And then I moved to Minnesota to play at Shattuck St. Mary's. I played two years of high school there and then moved on to Cornell, spent four years there, and now I'm here with Indy Fuel. Starting the uh, pro career. You know, we mentioned it right off the top there. You sort of are a versatile guy for the Fuel this year. You started the year playing mostly on the back end. You've chipped in in the forward group now the past several games. What do you like about both of those roles on the team? What do you like about playing up and playing back? Uh, I think right now I'm still more comfortable with defense because I've spent way more time playing defense for me. But uh, it's also fun for me to play offense because I can actually get up in the play, hit guys, like get a goal every once in a while. <laughs> so it's, it's, it's been fun playing both ways. Well, you certainly have a physical edge to your game, particularly when you're up front, as you mentioned. It seems like you're not shy about delivering hits and finishing checks and not shy about taking a few big hits too. Has that always been a part of your game, that physical aspect? Yeah, when I play offense, I try to be like really physical because you can finish your checks more often than on defense. Because when on defense the guy passes by you, you don't want to like finish your check. You want to get back behind. And but on offense, it doesn't really matter. You can still take a couple strides and hit the guy. So it's it's been a little bit better for me. Absolutely. Oh, Talk about your line mates here over the course of the past couple of weeks. It seems like you've slotted in nicely alongside Robert Zarnick and Garrett Bembridge. Yeah, it's been fun playing with them. I uh, I just try to be like a work workhorse for those guys. I try to get up in the four check, maybe disrupt and get the puck away from their defense and then get to those guys because they can score and maybe get an assist for me. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, you're playing on a Rockford contract right now. Obviously, the goal for all of you guys is to move up the ladder in terms of your development here. Mm -hmm. How does that motivate you every single night when you're taking the ice here in Indy, trying to get to the next level? Uh, for me, a long time ago, my dad told me whenever you get on the ice, like, give out your full effort because you showed up here anyway to the rink, so might as well show like what you got. So. For me, it's no different every day if it's a game or practice. If I'm in Rockford here, like I try to, I try my best every day in every game. Well, that shows out there. We appreciate the time. Thanks for this, girl. Thank you. Okay, that's another edition of Fuel Insider from our WebStream Sports Studios. I'm Tony Brown. Until next time, this is Fuel TV.